Okay. Imagine here. Young Shiori, little Shiori, and a young friend, a female friend of hers. We were the pure ones in the group. And that's because we have that strict upbringing. The repressed religious background, I suppose. Does that mean- I'm so pure! What do you mean, guys? Just because I have weird tangents doesn't mean I'm not pure. Come on! We were both say so. Gosh, it's so freaking weird how we had that group thinking about it. Like, the group was mostly normal. There was this one girl who always took crap in a weird direction. I'm eating my freaking lunch, and she's there at the side, and she starts talking about, like, anal out of nowhere. Like, I'm, girl, I'm freaking eating a peanut butter sandwich, like, every other freaking day. I got so annoyed with her constantly bringing up topics like this out of nowhere that I actually just moved the table over. I think it's one of those things, like, she was trying to brag or something. No, no, that girl who bragged about it, uh, her partner was like literally right there. And there was a strange love triangle between her, that dude, and my, my originally say-so friend. There was a very strange tension going on. I got fed up because that's all they ever talked about and I just literally wanted to eat my food without imagining, imagining the behind, okay? <laughs> This is like years ago. This is like my youth, essentially. Now, this say-so friend. She used to be so say-so. I thought she would be like as traditional as me. But after, after that time period in her life... <gasps> she, she went nuts. She, she found herself. Does that make sense? She used to be like a lot more uptight with the religious background. She... she... Okay, she... she... she went nuts. So many nuts! Like, like, Jesus Christ! Like, she... I... I was like, what happened to you? She was like, um... Anyway, and then she... What the heck happened? I thought you were allergic to nuts, and now you're here gobbling it left and right. Like, what happened? You were so... You were... you were traditional. <laughs> it was a shocker. However, 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 it's okay because she she's she she found someone since then and I I don't think she no longer goes nuts. I think I think she's the moment she also found someone, we started talking <laughs> Our friendship started. But but it's like it's one of those friends. Your friends either talk to you regardless of whether they have a relationship. Or they completely forget you exist because they have a relationship. It's- you only have one or the other option and it freaking sucks. It ve it very much sucks. I'm so freaking sick of that. Like, holy crap, are you supposed to be my friend? Or am I supposed to be the friend that you talk to when you're gobbling nuts left and right, you son of a- <sighs> I'm trying to be a forever friend, but here you are, forgetting I exist. It's like the moment I, you, the moment you find your forever nuts, it's like sorry, Shiori, go go. <laughs> uh, also, he hello, hello, manager, hello. I'm just talking about the friends I had. <laughs> Ooh, whoo. I, I was giving her advice and all that stuff for when she was uh kind of going. Crazy. It was like, maybe, maybe you should probably not do that stuff. So... Oh, RPG Maker! Uh, oh, yes. All these stories were on RPG Maker game. Right, right. 